Hello, my friends. Welcome to all my new and returning subscribers to my Southern Kitchen, the 319th episode and the seventh episode of Ellen's Thanksgiving series 2019. I'm Ellen. Hope all you're doing well. Before we begin, I want to wish everybody a happy Veterans Day. Thank you to all the men and women who served our country. We salute you. Today's recipe, I'm gonna show you how to make a classic staple and a must have at your Thanksgiving dinner, green bean casserole. And my friends, it is the bomb.com. It's gonna be so delicious. And as always, it is so simple and easy to make. And this would be great to make with your kids and your whole family is gonna enjoy this amazing side dish. You'll be digging in in no time. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box and also check out my Thanksgiving recipes playlist for more recipes. So turn on your oven, grab your french fried onions and your green bean sugar because we're about to bake some green bean casserole magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go! All right, my friends, in my medium bowl, we're going to add in one 10 and a half ounce can of cream of celery soup. Three fourths of a cup of evaporated milk. An eighth of a teaspoon of white pepper and a fourth of a teaspoon of smoked paprika to give it a little smoky flavor. Going to give all this a quick whisk until it's well incorporated. All right, my friends, now it's time to add in the two stars of the show the green beans. I'm using four cups of frozen green beans that I cooked, or you can use the fresh or the canned green beans. and two-thirds of a cup of french fried onions. Going to stir all these together until they're well combined. All right, my friends, I'm through mixing the green beans together. Now we're ready to pour it into our pan. We're going to pour it into an ungreased one and a half inch cord square baking dish. All right, my friends, I got the filling into the pan and you see how simple and easy this recipe was? Only called for six ingredients. And I forgot to mention, I use frozen cut green beans. All right, now we're ready to put it in the oven. We're gonna put it in the preheated 350 degree oven and we're gonna let it bake for about 30 minutes. And then we're going to come back and top it with the rest of the french fried onions. And we're going to let it bake a little bit more. All right, I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, this is what the green bean casserole looked like after 30 minutes. Mmm, it smells amazing up in this kitchen. So now we're going to add the rest of the french fried onions right in the middle like so and some on the sides oh this looks so good all right my friends so now we're going to put the casserole back in the oven and we're going to let this finish baking for five minutes All right, my friends, there you have it. Southern green bean casserole. Don't that look scrumptious? And you see the french fried onions is nice and golden brown. I wish it would smell a vision because it smells heavenly. 
All right, so now I'm going to let the green bean casserole cool for a few minutes and then I'll give it a taste. All right, my friends, now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Oh, yeah, hear that sounds nice and creamy. Ooh, look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all hear that crunch? So crispy. The green beans is tender. It's flavorful, has the right amount of seasoning. This green bean casserole is marvelous. Please give this recipe a try. Yum o. Oh. Green bean casserole delicious. My friends, many thanks so much for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. And I'll see you next time. Much love, let's eat, and happy Thanksgiving.